I'm Brad. I'm Jessica. Today we're going to try Nitro Creme Brulee from Southern Tier Brewing Company. I had the standard, but not the nitro version. I think I did that with you. Could have. Uh, Imperial Milk uh, Stout Ale Brewed with Vanilla Beans and Natural Flavors Added. Uh, best Buy 92421. This is the end of 2020. Christmas Day, actually. So, That's what we do on Christmas. Um, how did we do this last time? Did I pour it all in mine, then just... I have no idea what you okay. did. Okay, I'm just going to pour it all in mine. Um, I bought it at Megabev. I'll pour it all in here, then move it to hers. Wow. Exciting, huh? No. <laughs> There. Thanks. You're welcome. We got more. Great. Um, 10% ABV. Can you yeah. even read those things? Yeah. 10% ABV, uh, color, black, body, uh, creamy, heavy, uh, bitterness, moderate, 9.6 fluid ounces is what it shows. Nice, creamy, light chocolate colored head. About a finger of head, you've got about a finger of head. I look like too. I got like Neapolitan things going yeah. on here. <laughs> Nitro settling down. It's black. I do have a very dark amber hue at the bottom, but it's black. This is probably a little too cold. I'd probably let it warm up a little, but what it should be good. God, we had time. It. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot they were outside. It smells good. It smells sweet. I was almost going to say like a caramel marshmallow. Mm-hmm. It could be the vanilla. Yeah. That's, that smells that smells really good. I don't remember the other one, what that smelled like. It, it does have that smell <laughs> of higher ABV in it, and I don't know if it's just those roasted malts that I'm getting. I'm almost getting like a hint of almond. Yeah, it's like a... Like a amaretto, yeah. like a liquor. If I was doing this blind, I would say there's marshmallows in here. Like I like the smell caramel of Caramel marshmallows. And I like that it's creamy. Maybe it'll be nice and thick. <laughs> okay, let's taste. Look at that. Like... I like the body of it. Thick and creamy. This is like what milkshake stout should taste like. Is it too roasty for you, though? I mean, I don't like the taste of it. I wouldn't <laughs> even get that far. Um, the kid. It's like... Jake got a new game for the Switch, so he's obviously making noise. Um, It is a little too roasty for me. I can taste the vanilla. And I don't know if it's... I don't know what the other natural flavors are, but it... it I don't want to... It tastes like it's overdone. Okay. Like a little too much in the artificial or natural flavors in there. I do get a hint of the vanilla, but that that big roasted, dark roasted malt comes through. Mm -hmm. And there's there's something else like a caramel or something in there. It doesn't really say what the natural flavor is already. So it doesn't taste, the, the caramel doesn't taste burnt. Like I'm thinking you yeah. light it on fire. This would be an okay dessert beer if you liked vanilla. Yeah, it is on the sweeter side. I don't love it, but I didn't like, I don't think I loved any of the series, the um, the dessert series from them. We know we Fake ate the, mint. the, yeah, the mint and the Do Samoa. We have the, yeah, the cookie one. Yeah. I mean, it's okay. It's not amazing. I would go with a four out of five. I think it's pretty good. I would like to see that that roasted malt toned down just a little bit. I do understand it's 10% and you're going to get a little bit more of that. But 
I don't know. I guess the artificial flavor is probably the caramel. Because, mm-hmm. but shouldn't it be a little smoky, a little burnt? I'm glad it's not. Because I can tolerate this. As compared to, I'm glad it doesn't have a burnt caramel. I definitely... I don't like to eat creme brulee anyway. Yeah. I like the smell more than the taste. So do I. (laughs) On this one. But yeah, I would go four out of five. And you smell meat too. I smell like vanilla bean Uh, oil, so it's probably some of that. Double vanilla. Yeah. I'm going to go like three and a half. Okay. I didn't love it, but I didn't hate it, and I'm pretty sure that I won't drink it again. 14 of my friends have checked it in, average 4.21 out of 5. 11,000 people have checked it in, average 4.12 wow. out of 5. You think it's because it's thick and creamy? Mind-blowing. Interesting. Incredibly sweet. A little butterscotch note? Interesting. I but, don't know if I would say that. I mean, I could... W- I don't know if I'd yeah. say that. Beer exchange, heavy butterscotch notes. Maybe as you warm it up. Yeah, I mean, I could, I could actually see that with the uh, the roasted malt coming off as like a chocolate. Then that caramel maybe kind of mixing to give a butterscotch. But I think we're a little colder than warm today on this one. You had all day. Yep. You I knew. Did. You knew. Yep. <laughs> So if you enjoyed this video, check some more out over here. And until next time, I'm Brad. I'm Jessica. Happy brewing.